This week, we're talking about how the movie Megan killed it at multi-platform marketing. Another word you'll hear for multi-platform marketing is cross-channel marketing, which is essentially when we create the same content on the same campaign and we're pushing it out onto different platforms to extend our reach. Bloomhouse had a low-budget thriller feature called Megan that made massive rounds on social media. You probably saw it. And they had that tiny, tiny marketing budget. But by utilizing multi-platform marketing, they were able to turn that really small budget into a huge return on their investment. You saw them doing things like viral TikTok trends, viral Twitter threads, and even a beef between Megan and Chucky online. It was this very viral cross-platform way to market at a really low budget. So the first thing that you're really seeing as a result of this is a extended reach. Basic math, you release something on one platform, you're gonna reach less people than if you release things on multiple platforms. You're getting this massive reach for the same content that you're creating. So you're saving yourself money and reaching more people. You're also able to have a really enhanced targeting. Right, Because you've got the same content, but you're releasing it on different platforms, you can specialize that content for that platform and for the type of people who are going to be on that platform. So Bloomhouse was not creating the exact same content on Twitter that they were on TikTok, that they were on Facebook, that they were any other platform, because different people are interacting on those platforms and were able to to really specialize, really target the people we want based on each platform. So because we're pushing out on multiple platforms, we actually have an increased engagement because you're educating people and building interactivity on all of these different platforms. So if someone does interact on multiple platforms, they're able to interact with you in each place. So if I'm educated on Twitter and I still interact with you on TikTok in a way that I wouldn't have been before if I'm seeing it for the first time on TikTok. You're also getting higher engagement because it's more specialized to the platform that you're marketing it to. This also allows you to have really consistent messaging. If you're creating the same content and getting it pushed out to these different platforms, then you're able to stay really consistent in what you're talking about and how you're talking about it. And that's really important for your brand. It's really easy to get into the weeds as you're marketing on different channels in how you're talking about different things in different places. But if you're using the same content and pushing it to each platform, not only are you saving money and getting this increased reach, but but you're staying really consistent with how you're talking about your brand. And the other thing is you're getting a really high conversion rate. It goes back to the very first point. It's basic math. If you've got more people interacting on more platforms, then you're going to get more people converting for whatever your call to action is. So it's super, super important as a brand that you are pushing things out. Megan netted $180 million at the box office. Why are you letting these big companies be the only ones who get that kind of marketing money? They had a tiny budget just like you do for your brand, but they were still able to get massive results off this small budget. Don't let these big box marketers make the money off the low budget things that you could be doing. This is something you could easily be doing for you and for your brand and have a massive return on your investment. Create content and push it to multiple platforms. If you want to check out more, check out our website at lifestyle.media. And until next time, this has been New Gen Marketing.